Hey, my legion. How y'all doing today? I got, I got a cup. How y'all doing today? I got a couple more unique Japanese snacks that Michael Creek sent me. I thought, may I just do a couple a video when I get, I get to them? You know, I really appreciate them sending to me. And I asked, I reached out to Paul from Critical Waste Japan if he could decipher what some of these mean right here. And he was saying like, um, I believe it was this this one right here is like an old style rice cracker but I couldn't quite understand what it meant right here let's see okay go open it up yeah I thank you Paul and well thank you Michael Creek thank you Paul for Creek East Japan for helping me out find with some of these words he said it might be a type of rice cracker but different like a rice crispy type thing Really good. I thought I have like a chocolate taste to it. You know, it's like a rice cracker. Lots well, of flavors are a little dry. Very good though. I get an 8 out of 10. Hmm. Here's a pring that went along with that. Hmm. Very good. Another one I've really been fascinated with. It looks like a gummy game with something inside of it, like an egg or something. We'll look at a printing right there. You know, on the side right there. Now what Paul said. I made a little video asking Paul. He said the force said Mitachi Tanako, which could possibly be a brand name or something. But he said not sure about that though. But it's, he said sorry, but it's okay. So it looks like it could be a mochi candy or something inside. Might be red beans or something, or maybe some fruit flavor. Let's try this one. This is the one I was most interested in. Aside from the marble sticks, the marble sticks get are last. It's gonna be last though. It's weird. It has a weird, weird texture to it. I don't want to. I don't want to. Well, I'll just eat it like this. Okay. Inside's like a gel. That's so unusual. Wow. It writes like a fruit gel filling. I can't tell what type of fruit it was, but well, I thought it was a gummy. It had the look of a gummy, but the texture of a marshmallow. Very strange. Very different. I like that too. I give it an 8 out of 10. So I want to thank you very much, Michael Creek. And thank you very much, Critical uh, Eat Japan and Paul, for helping me decipher what some of these times were. It means a lot to me. Now, until next time, bye bye, please. Take care of my Legion. And I have a shirt that says, Take care of my Legion. Available for me and B Designs. And I'll put the link in the chips for that too. Alright, thank you. Take care, everybody.